Welcome back to Raw Reviews. It's Wednesday. I'm back from Walmart. What did I find this week? From PB and Me. It's the Chocolate Hazelnut Powdered Peanut Butter. You guys seem pretty interested in the last time I showed a powdered peanut butter, so I thought I'd look at a powdered Nutella. Or at least we hope it'll taste like Nutella. Sugar, chocolate, hazelnut. How can you go wrong with that? Let's look at nutrition facts. Bust this guy open and take a look. For two tablespoons or 12 grams, you're looking at 45 calories, 1.5 grams of fat, 6 grams of carbs, 1 fiber, 3 sugar, and 4 grams of protein. And this is what it looks like in the jar. You can smell the powdered peanut butter, and you can smell the cocoa. Whether it turns out to be hazelnut tasting or not, who knows? But that combination already smells good. So if you guys remember from the last video how the powdered peanut butter works, it's simple. It's a lot like a protein shake or any other powder. You take out the suggested serving size, and you mix it with water. Simple as that. As you know from the last video, Following the instructions didn't exactly work out. I got peanut soup, but that was easily fixed by adding a little bit more. This one is a little less clear. It says two tablespoons per one to two grams of water. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna add a bit to a bowl and then we're gonna mix until it gets to a consistency that we like. We'll do two tablespoons and then we'll measure it to water, see how much it actually takes me. One, two it is. We'll start off with one scoop of water, then we'll add more to see how much we need. Here we go. You know, just from experience, I got a feeling that might be enough. So with two to one, it's actually turning out a bit runny. This would be great as a sauce or something for an ice cream. Let's add a little more powder just to get a Nutella consistency. There we go. That's much better. I gotta say, it smells great. Let's check it out and see if it's anything near Nutella. The major taste here is just the cocoa powder. I'm getting like a little bit of hazelnut, but it's mostly just powdered peanut butter. There's no weird like sweetener taste or anything like that. So you're just kind of getting like a mild chocolatey flavor. If you're looking for a spread that is like low calorie and gets that chocolate craving out of the way, this could definitely do it. Let's try it on something. Dollar store rice cakes. Let's give it a good helping. Here's what it looks like on the rice cake. By the way, these rice cakes are great. Super crunchy. So if you got a Dollarama, definitely check them out. They're like a Polish brand. They're really good. Anyway, I digress. Back to the chocolate spread. Let's see if it's anything near a Nutella on a spread. We're just looking for chocolatey and sweet. Here we go. Just kind of makes it taste like a chocolate rice cake. So overall, what's my thoughts on PB and Me chocolate hazelnut powdered peanut butter? Guys, it's all right. It would help curb the want for a chocolate spread. But if you're looking for Nutella, look elsewhere. It just tastes like the regular powdered peanut butter, but we added a little bit of cocoa. I don't taste much of the hazelnut, but is it all right? Yeah, I definitely see this going great in like a shake, a spread for rice cake, or even if you shake it out a little bit up in milk and add it to your cereal, that'd be great too. So what does Ron give PB and me chocolate hazelnut powder peanut butter spread? Well, I'm not 100% sure of the market they are actually going after. Whether they are trying to be a Nutella or not could change my opinion. I'm going to assume that they were just looking for a chocolate peanut butter. So they kind of got it. Ron's going to give it. 6.5 out of 10. I'd still rather just have the regular powdered peanut butter. Anyway guys, this has been a quick round of reviews and another Walmart Wednesday. I found it at Walmart. Obviously I found it at Walmart. So if you have a Walmart near you, check it out. It's been a round of reviews. See you next time. No Nutella.